For the past 20 years, um, the only real treatment we've had that's been proven through clinical trials to help patients presenting with an ischemic stroke is IV TPA, intravenous tissue plasminogen activator. TPA is a medicine we give through an IV that dissolves um, a clot that's otherwise blocking an artery and causing a stroke. Even though this treatment can be helpful, um, most patients really never receive it. And over the past 20 years, perhaps 3% of all stroke patients ever received this treatment. Um, and those who receive it, although they can benefit, the treatment is not very helpful for patients who are having very severe strokes. Last year we saw publication of five randomized clinical trials that showed overwhelming efficacy of using mechanical thrombectomy in addition to IV TPA to restore blood flow and improve outcomes in patients. When we perform this thrombectomy procedure, often we're able to open the blood vessel within a matter of minutes. We consider that time is brain, every minute counts, and getting patients to the thrombectomy procedure as fast as possible is critical to obtaining the best outcome for the patient. We're talking about a difference of a major disabling stroke to being able to walk out of the hospital the next day. The thrombectomy devices that we use today um, look like stents, which are um, mesh tubes that um, we can open up inside a blood vessel in the body. In this case, that's maybe filled with a clot. And then we use this stent-like device to tangle up the clot, grab the clot, and then we actually pull the clot literally out of the vasculature. What makes it different than a stent is that it's actually attached to a long wire that um, we never completely release it from, and that allows us to hold onto the stent and then retrieve it from the body. So Frederick Hospital uh, was the first uh, hospital in the state of Wisconsin to be certified as a primary stroke center, which acknowledges its ability and expertise to provide IV TPA to patients as quickly as possible. Uh, and then more recently, over the last several years, is one of only three hospitals in the state to receive certification as a comprehensive stroke center, which means we are certified and recognized to provide interventional stroke therapy um, with appropriate neurocritical care backup 24 hours a day.